Welcome to a video about one of the best hidden secrets from TMS. TMS offers an awesome product to create modern charts with all frameworks. All frameworks, you might ask? Well, of course, I refer to Delphi frameworks or Pascal frameworks, meaning the VCL, FireMonkey, TMS Web Core, the web solution from TMS Software, and the LCL, which is the Lazarus class library. And with these frameworks, you can address Windows, macOS, Linux, and even the tiny little computer, the Raspberry Pi, using Lazarus. In addition to supporting multiple platforms, it also supports rapid application development. That means, just like you used to from other Delphi components, you drop the control on the form and you can double click it to open up the designer, which allows customization. And as it's a chart component, you need to write a little bit of code to add data points to your chart. But everything is fully customizable, both at design time and at runtime. And I'm not going to show you any more slides. Instead, I'm going to show you the real demo that comes with the product. So if you want to look into this demonstration, just download the trial of FNC charts from the TMS software website and open up the demonstration. And you can pick, of course, if you want it for FireMonkey, Lazarus, or for the VCL, which I've opened right here. There's only one form, and this form contains a chart component and different samples that you can pick. As said while presenting the slides, simply drop the control on the form, the TTMS FNC chart control, and double click it. This will open the design time editor in which you can design all properties with immediate visualization on the form. Again, at design time without actually running the application. However, let's run the application and see what kinds of charts the demonstration has to offer. And we start with a bar chart and we have mathematical formula. Here we have a sine and cosine. Then we can just plot daily temperatures with an area chart, area bar chart to be more precise. Then, for example, here we have different pie charts, donut charts. Then we have budget spending with a radar chart. And one of the most popular charts, the OHLC. If you're not into the stock market, OHLC stands for opening, high, low, and closing value of a stock. You can see right here the opening value the closing value and the bar represents the line between high and low. And the cool thing about this control is you do not only have customization options at design time so your customers can see the chart that you design. No, you can easily give your users the ability to customize the chart. So you can click on edit chart options here and this invokes the designer at runtime. And here you can offer customization options for your customers. The demonstration only shows some of the charts that are available. I wanted to put that out there. We have different line types. We have line charts, X, Y line, digital line, which has these jumps in there. We have area type charts. We have different bar types with stacked and stacked on percentage values. We have multi-point types. One of them is the OHLC chart. We have candlestick, box plot for statistical values. And then there's completely different types like markers, XY marker, pi, size pi, spider, and variable radius pi. So there's plenty of charts available to satisfy all your charting needs. And best of all, it's available for all the platforms, not just the VCL or not just for FireMonkey. You buy one control and you can supply this to all the frameworks with the same properties and events. So the learning curve to learn about FNC charts only applies once. Just don't take my word for it. I'm going to file, open recent, and I'm going to open the demo for the web application for this chart. So I'm going to open the main form. So this is not a form like a VCL form. If I go into the source code, you can see it's a T web form, meaning it is a TMS web core application. And if I run this, we start the TMS web core compiler. 
and the browser will be launched and not a VCL executable. Right there, this is the Chrome browser. It shows the main page of the application and the chart looks exactly like it would inside of the VCL application or the FireMonkey application. And I have the same charts on offer. I have sine and cosine, daily temperatures, customer satisfaction, budget spending, and financial data. All the same charts on a different platform, just like that into the web. So going back to the monthly car sales and clicking interaction, you even get career results. What bar has been clicked by the user? You can move the chart and you can resize the chart. So all of this is supported out of the box without any written code from you. So just to re-emphasize what you have to invest in time. If you want to use FNC charts on different platforms, that's the strength of this component. You only have to learn it once. The same properties will be used on all the different platforms. The look and feel of the control will be the same on all the different platforms and the setup for you as a developer will be the same on all the platforms. So you learn it once, you invest time once, and you can use it in all the use cases for your Delphi applications. Don't hesitate, go to fnc.tmssoftware.com and download FNC charts. You will be amazed how easy it will be to include modern, visually attractive charts into your Delphi applications.